Hey YouTubers, so um, I've been working over my doors on my 57 Chevy and I want to give you a few tips in case you are uh, working yours over and needing some ideas. If you're not insistent on um, putting back totally original weather stripping, let me show you a good alternative uh, method that I found that works for me. So it tightens up the glass and everything. So as you can see, I did get my weather stripping, and I did use the original soft seal. That's that's the best way to go then with that. But 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 what I'm addressing is all of the glass run up in here. I mean I mean all up in there. So what I did to make this really quick as I can. So this track right here fits down in here for the window glass. So I cleaned it up, cleaned all the crud out of it. And I've got uh, weather stripping adhesive in here setting up. I've got um, I've got my glass run right here, which I gave you the part number on that. I bought this from like Summit, or and that's the part number on it. And it's just universal glass run for for like a universal hot rod, and it works for this '57 Chevy. So I, so you, they they sell it in an eight foot strip. You can cut it in half, and four foot will do each door. So anyway, so I got, uh, so I laid my weather stripping. There's my glass run. Right there's the glass run, and it works fine. There's certain flat spots up in here where the, where the glass run then will touch on. So I, in, in the black, I've got those glued, waiting for that to, to dry up. Got it glued down here. Went ahead and glued my track. Got it glued. I'm like as well. I'm fixing to install that. So I took a marker and I marked. I laid my glass run up in there and I marked where those flat spots hit on the glass. So then I glued that. And, and, and then this is the back of the glass run. So I glued that. So when I get ready to put it in, I will put, push it. I will already have my track here installed. Then I will push it in and just run it down through there and then run it down in my track and glue it in. Uh, as far as the window goes to repair that, I'm going to clean this old weather stripping out of there. Clean that worn out stuff out. And I'm simply going to use like, a, like an automotive type carpet, like a universal carpet that you can find. Um, and I'm going to cut a strip of it and push it down in there. I'm going to use gray. And push it down in there and that works pretty good all the way down through there it's a nice affordable option and you can use the same weather stripping adhesive to glue that strip in which I, I have the permatex I have the permatex but you got to make sure it's weather strip adhesive there's many different brands it's all the same stuff but it's basically contact cement so I'll glue a strip of carpet in this right here and trim it off with a razor Gives a nice snug fit on the window. Tightens everything up really, really well. Uh, also making my door panel, and, and I've got that already fabbed up, and, I'm, and then I'll put that on after the fact. But this wet, I mean, but this window run right here works out really nice. Nice stuff right here. Anyway, Hot Rods Woodshed. Thanks, maybe I give you some ideas. It's an easy fix, it's not too bad. You know, you can figure the better part of a day fixing it, but it's not too bad. Peace out. Y'all have a good day. 57 Chevy.